Welcome to the 2015 instructional video for the app, Loss of the Night. Here we show the app being downloaded on an iPhone 5. However, the app is also available on Android devices. After you have read and agreed to the app terms, tap Accept and you're ready to go. Here this takes us straight to the Project Information screen, which you can see is usually the top option in the left-hand menu. This section of the app provides a lot of information about other programs running in conjunction with this app. The light pollution section helps give a great in-depth explanation about what light pollution is and why we should care. Here you can see helpful tips for your stargazing, like making sure to keep track of your surroundings at night and giving your eyes time to adjust to the light levels at night. Also, make sure that you are not near any bright outdoor lights when taking your measurements, as this can affect your readings and eyesight. On the user data screen, you are given the option to look at all of your past measurements, and are given two screens to customize your data collecting experience. Make sure to configure all options in a way that applies to you, in order to send the most accurate data. Next is the tutorial section for the actual data collection. Make sure you read through this carefully to get the best results and stay safe doing so. First of all, make sure you are doing your data collection at night. When using the star map, it is important to remember that you do not collect the data through your phone screen. The correct process is to hold up your phone to the night sky to see what stars should be visible. And once the screen freezes and indicates a specific star, it is time to put down your phone and check if you can see the star yourself. Then you are all set to log in that data. We are going to skip the data collection screen for now and head to the news section. Here you can see all the recent news about this app, as well as light pollution in general. You can also see there is an option to import your data from a sky quality meter. There is also a feedback option which allows you to email the Loss of the Night team with questions or concerns. This next option toggles the day and night settings for the app. Now we can start observing stars. Make sure your phone is held at the correct horizontal angle. Now that you have explored all this app has to offer, you are ready to go out and collect data.